Hi, my name is Mr. Graves, and I'm going to be your teacher this year. Um, going to keep this pretty general for all of my classes, um, but I am teaching learning strategies, basic algebra, and um, gen ed algebra co-teach. So you may have me for one or multiple of those classes. Um, this is my fifth year teaching. Uh, I think that this year, I'm, I mean, <clears throat> thinking about it, this year is probably, um, I'm the most nervous for school than any other year. Um, even when we went to distance learning last year, um, I knew my students. I'd have at least uh, through March to get to know them, their needs, and and then to be able to transition into distance learning. This year, I'm meeting all of you for the first time, not in class, but um, through a digital platform. So it's it has me pretty nervous, but um, I'm going to do my best to be clear, to um, give you assignments that make sense, to ask from you um, what what you can do, and and to not expect. Um, ridiculous, ridiculous um, amounts from you. So part of my favorite uh, thing, this is my fifth year teaching, like I said, um, part of my favorite um, aspects of teaching is being very thoughtful in the way that I create curriculum, um, or not so much create, but sequence, and in what I ask you to do. Um, to give you opportunities to see how you really are capable of being successful um, in each and every um, area of content that we're going to be working in. So whether that's a learning strategy or if it's in our algebra content, okay? Um, family, I just wanna share, I have a, a wife. I just um, celebrated my 11th anniversary with her and we have a new daughter, she was born in April, so right at kind of all of the craziness of um, COVID and those things starting up, um, she was born April 5th, and um, she's been an absolute joy to have at home, uh, especially being stuck at home with uh, the social distancing and everything, um, getting to spend time with her and just take care of her. I'm sure I'll be sharing pictures and uh, when I'm at at home you may see I may bring her into the videos or whatever just to uh, to let her say hi um, so I really 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 do enjoy teaching math um, just like probably most of your teachers I didn't sign up uh, to teach online I love getting to get to know you spend time in class with you um, build like those relationships especially in high school uh, high schoolers are very relational and and part of what I enjoy about my job is getting to know you. Um, that can still happen in a digital classroom, um, but it's very different from uh, kind of how it naturally takes place in the classroom. Um, some of my hobbies, I, I play guitar. Um, I love to snowboard. Uh, I ride dirt bikes and motorcycles, and I enjoy mountain biking. So those are just a handful of my hobbies. I, I like to follow Supercross um, and Motocross, and uh, if you're interested in those things, um, I talk to you about those all day long. Um, in terms of my school experience, I just wanted to share with you, I wasn't an amazing student in high school. I didn't get straight A's. Um, I kind of just um, squeezed by. I spent a lot of time um, just trying to stay under the radar or off the radar. Uh, I could do the work, but didn't really like being called out, didn't really like being called on. Uh, that Any of that attention gave me anxiety. So um, as kind of an, in, uh, I guess I'm like an intro, I'm like a professional extrovert. So I'm introverted in that I recharge by being alone, kind of um, not being around people. But I enjoy, I do enjoy being around people and I, and I can, I can, I can uh, be in a group, talk in front of people, those kind of things, but it drains me versus like being recharged um, when I'm, when I'm alone. So my school experience, I was not a great student. 
Um, I procrastinated a lot. I um, would forget about assignments and those kind of things. So I, I feel like maybe you might be in a similar boat and I'm very much looking forward to working with you, to helping you find strategies, um, to being um, just on your team. I want you to know that I'm, that I'm rooting for you. This is a very, very, very hard way to do school. And um, I want to help you get through it. Uh, this year, just kind of talking about that, is very different. Very different than what we're used to. Um, so part of this is I'm going to be trying new things. One, I hate filming myself. This is just so uncomfortable, if you can tell. Uh, I don't know where to look. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe, it, hopefully, it's coming across as natural. But, you know, if I'm being completely honest, this is very uncomfortable for me. Um, and it's something that I'm going to have to learn to get more comfortable with uh, because uh, it's probably not going away at least for a while. So um, part of this year being different is that I'm going to have to try new things um, in terms of how, how I give you work, uh, how you show what you've learned, um, just how do we do school. We're doing school different. And especially in my math class, not so much in learning strategies, but for those in my math class, uh, it's going to be a little bit of an adjustment to figure out, you know, what what are the best practices for you to learn the material? And I feel like I have a good a good idea of how to give you the material and uh, teach, but how do you practice it? How do you show me that you've learned it? That's going to be kind of the a little bit more of the difficult part for my algebra students, okay? So it's gonna be very different. I'm gonna try new things. They're probably gonna fail, um, probably not gonna work out well, or um, some of them will, some of them won't. Um, but I think just kind of as a, as a last ending note, a commitment to personal growth. Um, let's commit to um, take each challenge as it is, to grow, to be better through this, and um, and to support one another as we're going through um, just the weirdest time in history, maybe in the history of forever. I don't know about the history of forever, but um, it's, it's certainly a strange time in the world. And so let's commit to grow through this time and to work together. So I uh, look forward to getting to know you better and um, seeing you in class and working with you this year.